Yo! Sometimes it's just fun to play one. I don't know. It's just interesting. We used to think those were good quality. Uh, anyway, welcome. Here we are, everybody. Uh, last time we went through most of this route, I would say. Um, you know, did some things. Finally taught a fire move, and then promptly got rid of the guy we finally taught a fire move to after he did learn one fu whatever. Um, so we are uh, just progressing through this route, and uh, gonna go see what's next. I believe the goal was to meet Cynthia's granny. How cute, she already wants us to meet the family. Uh, we'll beat up these ace trainers. Because ace trainers, I, I think, are worth fighting. They're fun, they're always a little bit more difficult, they give you a little bit more money, um, they always have cooler sprites, whatever. Ace trainers are like the mini-bosses. They got more Fire Emblem style hair, whatever. Okay, we've got, you know, Giravire on sale. Wish.com version, but Giravire. Well, uh, going to be a little more interesting now. Let's see. At least there's no rain. Yo, what's up, A-Team? Um, I don't really want to high jump kick him, though. I guess I can probably high jump kick Raichu. That's probably fine. Um... Do we try and body slam gear? No. Ugh, I mean, what do I do? Ice beam? It's at least neutral, but it's not stab. Yo, what's up, Land Shark? A bear called Dog? Hello, hello. The Raichu doesn't have lightning rod. I don't know what it has. I'm not gonna use lightning on it anyway. Oh, I see what you mean. I can use lightning on Gyarados because it doesn't have... I'm still probably just gonna get rid of Raichu first anyway. Um... Because if Gear is by himself, and he's not really a threat, so... Uh, I'll throw Ice Beam, though, just in case one Kickman kills him first. Thunderbolt! Ow. Psh. Okay. Maybe I'll get a Freeze Hex. Although I have a feeling one Kickman's probably about to bite it. Storm Drain! Thanks for the boost! Oh my god, I didn't even think about that. And now I hit you back extra more hard. Oh, it was a crit. Okay, well still. Yo, that was legit super cool. They've got one Pokemon each? What kind of ace trainers are you? You suck. I'm gonna kill you with a Psychic just because you intimidated me. Look how smug he looks. He's like, yeah, I'm about to give away all my money. with brain damage. Alright. Sweet! Okay. Uh, that's the easiest ace trainer I'm ever going to fight, I think, for the rest of the game. Little butt- Yo! He just got friend zoned so hard! Like, they're out on this Pokemon date and whatever, and then they see me rolling along and like, hey, let's beat up this little girl. And then he's just like, no, he's just my little buddy. Damn, dude. Yeah, I, uh, I stayed a little bit late at work, and then I set the next four videos to YouTube to upload scheduled um, just all at once so I don't have to worry about doing it during the course of the day. Uh, and it took a while because I was uploading all four at once, so that took a little bit. And then my computer had to do like restarting things and like blue screens and whatever. So yeah, we only have time for one episode today, but whatever. Exactly! See? That's the reaction you're supposed to have when you just get friend zone. Oh, that's not what he said, but... Damn! They got a lot of money! Can I verse seeker you guys? Oh, somebody mentioned that last time, but they're rich as hell. I'm a failure as your instructor. Oh, it's like teacher, whatever. It's still... Yeah, but she... 
This is a weird, like, little dynamic they got going on. Alright. That's not even with amulet coin? Oh my god, you're right. That's not even amulet coin. Well, here's another ace trainer. Sneak up from behind him. At least this one will be one on one. Ace Trainer Ernest. At least he's got three Pokemons. He sends out a bug. Well, he's hot for teacher. I hate that song. Because it's just not fun at all on drums. It just sounds like a mess. It sounds like when your little niece or nephew comes over to the house and they sit down at your drum set and they just hit shit for like 30 seconds until their parents tell them to stop. Like, that's the intro to Hopper Teacher. I hate it. It's awful. It's so bad. Um, well, I should probably switch, so... What do we switch to? Could switch to a Fire Mon if, you know, I gave it Flamethrower. But I didn't. Uh, I guess we'll just show off some more Rafflecopter. Confusion! Uh, t -bolt. Got him. That's right, I had a Magnemite, and then when it fought a lot, it became three Magnemites stuck together, and then I fed the three Magnemites a rare candy, and then, uh, now it's a Disco Frisbee. You don't know who- I don't know either. <laughs> don't know, don't care. There's only like three or four musicians' names I even know in the first place. Hey, try attack Useful right here! try attack is super cool! Roar! It's a good thing I didn't Volt Switch, because I was about to until I saw I had try attack He's relaxed. Yeah, he's like, ooh, an, elect uh, an electric Pokemon. I'm good now. I'm gonna spit some bullet seeds at it. Zero speed. Onyx, even better. I feel like a lot of people picked, uh... I almost said Terrakion again. Jesus. This guy. Again. Grass ground is greater than fire? I mean... Doesn't Infernape just one-hit KO first, though? That's the problem. Infernape is... It's pretty good. Yo! Flash Cannon! Do we get rid of Tri-Attack, then? I mean, because obviously the stab is nice, so it's 50% more powerful. Um, steel type kind of sucks to attack with, but I'm going to use T-Bolt unless T-Bolt is resisted. So what's going to resist T-Bolt? Ground, Flash Cannon beats it. Uh, electric, which, okay, so then I can't win a mirror match, which sucks. I always... Try attack is not winning... Actually, no, I was thinking... Like, actual Steel-type mirror match. Um, yeah, that's true. It does help against Fairy, which being Steel-type I want to switch into. Um, I do really like having Tri-Attack here. It's like an awkward amount of coverage, because normal isn't exactly coverage. Yeah, you can get weird hacks with it, which is fun. Um, Torterra would probably... Oh, then you don't have Ground-type against Charizard, though. Obviously against Ape, you just Earthquake him and then he dies, but not against Charizard. Um, God, you know, I really honestly don't want to lose Tri-Attack, but T-Wave is, is too good. It makes me unable to hit Electric-types. And I always value being able to switch into your own type and beat up your own type. At least I guess I could Volt Switch away. I wouldn't switch into one. I mean, maybe I would, actually. <laughs> maybe I would, because they can't hit me either. Um, 
know. I would end up just Volt Switching out. I'm not losing Volt Switch. It's too cool. I, I mean, getting rid of Tri-Attack is the right decision. It just makes me sad. I do have a ground starter. Oh well. Whatever. God, we're already 10 minutes into the video. We just fought two trainers, that's it. You don't have nearly as much cash. You're pretty amazing. Why, thank you. Uh... How, how does walk the tight... Is that a, for a bike, maybe? Yo, that's terrifying! Are you serious? How did he get here? Ninja Boy Davy. You know, I, I think if we go back through the Chronicles and find all of the ninja, I don't think any of them are going to be called Davy. Just... Just thinking about it. Um... I'm probably not gonna one-hit KO him, but we'll give it a try. Taught you Psychic for a reason. Oh well. Light screen, hey! And we did 60%, right? We should be able to get a kill there. 66%, whatever. Yo, Davey, you suck. Give me half your cash. <laughs> I love how Edward is just spontaneously level 29 when we have no intention of like ever actually using him. He's just sitting there. Your ninja techniques failed. You're poor as hell, kid. Get richer parents for me, thanks. Alright, so do I want to take this way? I'm just trying to find which way to go, but whatever. Black Belt Adam. A choke. Hiya. I guess maybe now I can Oh, I can just drain punch now though, because I'll I'll get some value out of that here. Can't drain punch the dust ox as well, but this is fine. And I resist his own fighting attacks. Cool stuff. Oh no! And slow drain punch. Still faster. How? I mean, if you just look at those two Pokemon, how is this little guy the quicker one? Like, if I had to run away from them, I would definitely much rather feel safer running away from Garlic Jr. over there. Oh well. He's psychic. Uh, I mean, we can teach Taunt for now. I'm gonna get rid of Taunt eventually. Definitely can get rid of Roar, though. I don't need Roar at all. And then I'll end up getting rid of Taunt for, you know, Flamethrower once I get to a town and I can fly back to the mall. Alright. We're playing too casually. Taking too long. Yes, your training was nice. Get off the bike! God, I hate the bike in this game. Alright. No! <sighs> I actually got surprised by that ninja. I was just thinking, hey, that's a weird, like... Thing on the ground that looks like a leaf. I wonder if it's an invisible item. I could tell something was there. I did not anticipate Ninja. Bloody hell, the same way Yoda is quicker. Oh, he's got. Is Psychic type the same thing as the Force, though? Yeah, trolled by ninjas. Bolbat. I love how the sound effect for Psychic hasn't changed in, what, 25 years? Roughly?
Okay, can we be done with trainers now? I've gotten a couple level ups, I've gotten a bunch of money. Yeah, I'm not complaining, it's a good sound effect. I'm just... Smoke ball? Is that like a getaway thing? Or is that a catch a poke? Okay, is that other items? Um... I don't... Is there a hidden item over there? Crap, what am I gonna do? Uh, this sucks. There. How do I get down there? Do I have to waterfall down there? Alright, well. Oh, I have to go that way anyway? Damn. I was trying to avoid. Oh, well. Ooh, Shadow Ball. I mean, that's a good move. I don't have anyone on my team who's going to want it, but it's a good move all the same. Alright, I guess I have to go fight the bird trainer. Can I put Ifrit in front, or is Ifrit just going to die? Ifrit's just going to die. Uh, wow, everyone's actually a good level now. They're all like the same thing, except for... I mean, you don't count. I can get rid of you. You're just there. Uh, huh. Well. Slughorn it is. Sad. Hey, thanks, Mad Media. Yeah, we've, uh, we've had to do a lot. <laughs> but it's coming along. It's getting there. We're making progress. My entire life savings is gone. But... Whatever. At some point I'll die and who the hell cares when my brain counts us, so... Can Scooby Doom learn it? Why would he want to learn it if I can just learn Dark Ball stuff? I have a Stonks house. And I'm sure by the time I want to sell said house, uh, the market's gonna crash, because it's gonna be somewhere between four to eight years from now when I want to sell it. It'll be worth less than what we bought it for, regardless of the however stupid many tens of thousands we put into it. So, you know... Why did I switch to water? Whatever, I don't care. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's gonna... At least I'll have it, yeah, obviously. <laughs> you know, buying a house when you don't have a house to sell sucks. Buying a house if you do have a house to sell is a lot better. Um, even if you are going to get screwed by the market, at least you can take advantage of it when you buy and then lose out when you sell. It's, it's better. So, you know. Did I ever get a new Entei? I swapped him out with a different one that we caught um, because he's got Sucker Punch and Flash Fire. So, um, he's got a negative Acupressure. Do I want to learn Acupressure for fun? Sharply boosting one of it or its allies. It's a random one, though, right? Okay, so acupressure is only good with uh, abilities that, like, do stuff when your stats change. Is that correct? Because if it's just a random stat, I don't care. It's very interesting, though. Because with Drain Punch, and technically with Psychic, I could argue that I take use of all of the stats. I don't need low kick if I'm going to have drain punch and high jump kick. But, I'm also not really going to be using acupressure all game long or anything. But you know what, maybe for fun, and that's what we're here for, is fun. Screw it! Let's just do it, I don't care. It'll suck, whatever. For a second, I was like, I was like, this is gonna be another ninja that's gonna pop out and get in my way. But I'm already searching for God, how many trainers are there? Please stop. I don't I don't want. I did not anticipate having one video today for a short stream that we're recording. And the entire thing is just trainer battles. But I guess we're literally just having trainer battles. Well maybe we'll go a little bit longer though. 
Hey, I uh, need like a grass knot or something. I guess I'll just body slam him. That's fine. Will it be my final mod? I don't know. I really don't know. Um, because obviously we'll get rid of Scyther for something. Uh, not that I don't like Scyther, but he just he doesn't have the right nature or anything or ability that I want. Um, I just didn't plan on it. I don't know. I mean, we. Honestly, we could use him, though. We really could. There's no reason we don't have to. Uh, we are getting rid of Gligar. What the hell was that move? Um, cause somebody told us that uh, we don't get to evolve into Gliscor until post-game. So... I'm not going to use Gligar if I can't evolve him. So he's cut. Straight up, he's gone. Um, I'm not necessarily married to Metacham. I don't feel the need to necessarily keep it if I don't want to. Um, same with Scyther. So, but I do feel confident with these other four. I feel like I'm okay thinking we've got four Pokemon. So. Um, you know, maybe we just use Dialga. I don't know. I could see that. It would be fine. Um, I might need it against Garchomp. Swap to Crobat. Um, I do certainly need a Flying type with uh, Gligar being gone. What am I gonna do though, you know? Like in theory, I could get a Togepi underground, that'd be cool for Togekiss. In theory, I could get a Yanma in the Safari Zone and have Yanmega. But I also want to use things, like I said, I've never used before, too, so... Um, actually, that completely takes Yanmega out of it. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I would use for a flying type. Initially, I was actually thinking I would use uh, Pelipper, or Pelipper. Pelipper. But... No, I guess I did use him once on an NU team. Or was it NU? Was it an NU team? I don't know. I feel like I have used him. I use him in Thanksgiving battles as well. Um, so maybe I maybe I wouldn't be allowed to actually use him. Okay, well this route is over, I think. Please no trainers. Oh, berries. Okay. Um, which those Thanksgiving theme battles that we did for a few years, those were really fun. I really liked those. I always wanted to do more, but I was like, what other themes are we going to do, unless I just do the same thing again? But, you know, there's only so many bird Pokemon, so... Okay, well... I guess we're done. Here we go! <clears throat> yeah, local history? You mean the history of how you can Google for a video? of how to get Dialga and Palkia in the same game, and it involves going to this town after talking to some dude, and then like pushing some menu buttons, and then going in the cave, and it's totally not anything bad. It's true facts confirmed gonna work glitch. Go look up that video. <laughs> Local history. God, when was that? Was that 2008? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna... We're going to talk to the townsfolk here. We're going to see what's in the town. Uh, Cynthia did ask us to check up on her Meemaw. I should make an update. I, I did think about that. But with how many random glitches and crap there are now... Nah. There probably actually is a way to do it for real, so... But also people now would know better. I'm sure Kazo would have proven that it's just, like, not a thing that could even happen with a glitch. It's alright. Plus, at the time, it was, like, a really popular thing of, like, posting glitches and stuff like that, and finding glitches authentically was a popular thing at the time. So it was like, hey, I could do this and, like, get fun amounts of views for basically no reason, and it'll be funny. And, you know, whatever. Oh, I didn't even read her text box. There's no Pokemon. You can buy and sell items in the house right next to you. Okay, great. Um, so, you know, part of it was, was just to troll for that.
Hey! Houndoom! Houndoom! I got you some shades! Ah, enables the holder to flee from any wild encounter. That's cool. Black glasses to the dog. Give it to the dog. Okay. Alright, here to buy. Uh, I don't need any of these, I don't think. Ooh, revives? I, uh, I've got three. Which I probably could go for a few extra. Having more revives is never a bad thing. I've got some repels. I'll buy one revive because I pushed the wrong button. Why not? Support local businesses. None of this capitalist mega corporation polka mart garbage. Yo, dust ball, quick ball, and timer ball. Wait, what? Uh, isn't this like the worst ball in the game? I'll buy a few anyway, just because I like... I guess I'll buy 10 because I want premier balls. Um, just to match it with the color of Pokemon. Like maybe there's something this applies to, although then I would just use a premier ball, whatever. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll have it out there. Maybe, maybe it'll come into use at some point. But I've got enough of the rest for that for now. Um, route 211. Let's not leave yet. What up, kid? Okay. Nice, it displays the time. Too bad I've already got a clock, but it's all right. There's an odd spaceman in front of the ruins. Well, let's heal up, because we took a small amount of damage. Finish going through the town. Well, somewhere in here, find Cynthia's grandmother. Check the menu next step now. All right. Sweet, thanks, dude. Stop the Spaceman. <laughs> spaceman Spiff! Alright, that, that's not where I need to go. Um, that's not where I need to go. Geez, really? Is the only place here? Okay. Should I save the game? Are there any invisible items? Nah. Wait. Really? Okay. Darn, I actually thought there would be one. Bummer, dude. Okay, I'm gonna save the game just in case. I do need to get Flamethrower. God, I don't want to forget that. Don't let me forget that. Insignificant! There's nothing of value here. It doesn't need to exist. I'll blow it up with a galactic bomb! I'll shut you down with a Pokemon battle. What's it gonna be? Are you gonna mess with me? You're taking on the world! No, you're taking on the universe! Alright. I mean, Goku wants to fight all the strong fighters in the entire universe, and all other universes, so... Who are you? Slughorn is excited, because he wants to hit this bug with some ice. Yo, what's up, man, Dandy? Yo, Quick Claw Gastrodon's amazing. He's got a ba bomb.
<sighs> if I take Edward out, is everyone gonna gain more EXP? Probably not. Uh, let's see here. I guess I will just body slam. Sucker punch. Don't make me predict you with a recover. Okay, I won't. I won't predict you with a recover. I just got worked over by a kid, no less. Dun 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 dun! That's right. I suppose I will. Doesn't this just like add pages to your Pokedex or something stupid? Ancient cave painting! Now with updated 2021 HD graphics XXX. The legends of his forthcoming have been told or whatever. being so powerful. The Triforce of Pokemon. Dun dun dun! Surf? Wow, Cynthia just has extra Surf TMs hanging around that she doesn't need anymore, so do her Pokemons not know Surf? Or maybe all of them know Surf. Okay. Yeah, right. Illuminati. Alright. No invisible items. A little bit sad. Um, so now let's, uh... I guess this is all for this town, huh? Oh my god, can you walk, please? Um, oh! A universal scale! This guy just looks... I don't know. I'm Cyrus. I seek the power to create a new world. A world without strife, but we like Cloud. FF7's amazing! That power seems unavailable here. We've met before, yes? If you discover any power derived from the legends, inform me. I don't need to give you... What? White dude, you don't need any more power. You're already... Wait, and phone call. Oh, why? Stop. Uh, I'm not even... Okay, so we've got a route to head out over there. Um, but I think I'm going to go fly to the town, teach. Actually, we're going to plant some berries here, because next time we play, I'll actually pick up the berries, I think. Because that'll be tomorrow, right? So we'll plant some berries. We will go... Buy flamethrower again. Sure, we'll plant something. Uh, citrus. Where were those citrus berries I just picked up? Um, we will teach surf. We will teach flamethrower. We will fly back here, and that will be the end of the video. And then tomorrow we'll do whatever the hell this route looks like it is. Looks like it's a big mess. Plant more berries. Do I have any other berries that are worth planting, though? Not particularly. Yeah, I guess I'll just plant random EV reducing berries. Because I may as well put something here. Alright, let's 
water said berries. Why does the watering animation take forever? Am I supposed to push a button? Is that why it takes forever? I don't know. Whatever. I don't care. Alright, so I need... To fly. No, not cut. Oh my god, are you serious? Really? It thought that this was... I can't get on it. Whatever. Whatever, I don't care. Fly. Uh, Veilstone? Where's Veilstone? Veilstone? I think it was Veilstone. Yo, what's up, Jaster? Okay. I, uh... Need to find... A shopping center? This isn't it. What is this building? There it is. Ran right by it. How do I get there? Oh, from here? Seriously? All right, let's buy uh, another flamethrower. Sweet. Okay. We got a flamethrower. We... Where's TMs? Here's TMs. We got Surf. We're gonna give Surf to Slughorn. Yo, so what if you teach... Oh, never mind. Get rid of Water Pulse. I was gonna say, what if you teach away all your surf TMs and then like you can't surf anymore, but there's the the watch, so. Yeah, Gligar got cut. So. Where did Flamethrower go? I wish you would just be alphabetical. I mean by number makes sense as well, sort of. Nobody knows the numbers in order, but. Oops. Okay, uh, I can get rid of smog. I can sort it. I thought it only lets you sort by the name TM in order, or by the number of the TMs in order. I hate this game. I hate this game. This game is so bad. <laughs> Pokemon Unbound is just so much better. It's ridiculous. Alright. Let's fly back to the town and uh, prepare ourselves... ...to continue on with our story. Um, what town was that even? Crap. Oh, that's just gonna take us here? Well, that's fine. It's probably taking us to a different spot there, so it's fine. I think. Is this where I get lost in the game? <laughs> I keep waiting for me to get lost somewhere. Uh, no, I need to go back to Hearthrum. Yes, we have a gym battle next time. Something more entertaining. No, not save the game. Stop it. Get Hearthrum. Hell to the yes. All right, gym battle tomorrow. Next time. Yeah, right. Um. I don't think I need to use a focus center, but we're gonna do it anyway. We will go park our butt in front of the gym.
Does it feel like it's skipping? I feel like it's skipping. Whatever. Here we are. End of the episode. End of the stream. End of the video. I will catch you guys all back tomorrow for the next one. Gonna have some fun. Gonna beat up the gym. Now we have a flamethrower dog that wears black glasses. So that's pretty cool. And uh, that's all we got. So we'll end with three throws of rock, paper, scissors because it's fun that way. Uh, rock, paper, scissors, shoe. Rock, paper, scissors, shoe. And rock, paper, scissors, shoe. The triple paper because we're, uh, whatever, I don't know. There we go. So, will I beat the... Oh, no! 18! No! The 8 ball is going to be wrong this time. That's too bad. Well, whatever. The 8 ball is going to get bailed out because it's a different day entirely. So, the 8 ball is going to get another chance tomorrow. Since it's not going to come to fruition today either way. Take it easy, everybody. We'll catch you later.